An investigation has been launched into incarcerated dancehall entertainer Vibes Cartel and his continued involvement in the music, producing hits after hits, even though he's behind bars. Hi again and welcome. This is Links 007 TV News Report, and we'll be right back with the full details to come. Welcome to Links 007 TV News Report, providing you with the best in local and international news updates. This is a place where you can get the most reliable and informative news information. Links 007 TV News Report. Welcome back and thanks for joining us. This is Links 007 TV News Report. An investigation has been launched into incarcerated dancehall entertainer Adija Palmer, more popularly known as Vibes Cartel, and his continued involvement in music. Speaking at the Antigua and Barbuda's Ministry of Legal Affairs and Legal Symposium held in St. Kitts, Jamaica Deputy Commissioner of Correction at the Department of Correctional Services, Joyce Stone, said that Vibes Cartel's appearance in music videos and the entertainer's continued release of music is prohibited and has not been sanctioned by the correctional services in Jamaica. She said that while entertainers such as Jakir was allowed to do music while he was incarcerated as part of his rehabilitation strategy, that is not the case with Adija Palmer, more popularly known as Vibes Cartel. She continued by saying that Adija Palmer, more popularly known as Vibes Cartel, is an appellant. She explained that inmates that are appellant are considered innocent until proven guilty and are not engaged in such activities. The public has been wondering over many years how Vibes Cartel continued to dominate the local and international music space by producing and releasing a number of songs. It is not sure whether the dancehall entertainer has done any recording while he was incarcerated. Links below 7 TV will continue to track this story and provide you with the latest information to comment this. Thanks for watching.